you guys informed on what's going on. Um, love you all. If you if you have any information, um, you know, please just contact your local authorities. Um, everybody, continue to just keep your prayers. We've been working closely. Uh, we've been working closely with everyone to just try to get to the bottom of this. The city of Houston, HPD, fire department. You know, everyone to, uh, you know, help us, help us figure this out. So, I mean, I'm, I'm honestly just devastated, and I could never imagine anything like this just happening. And I'm gonna do everything I can to keep you guys updated and just keep the show and, you know, help them get the help they need. You know, um, I could just never imagine the severity of the situation. Um, I just want to send out prayers to the to the ones that was lost last night. We're actually working right now to identify the families so we can help assist them through this tough time. You know, my fans, my fans, like my fans, really mean the world to me, and I always just really want to leave them with a positive experience. And any time I can make out, you know, anything that's going on. You know, I, you know, I stopped. Now, you heard a little bit of what Travis Scott had to say, but this is what Kylie Jenner had to say. Travis and I are broken and devastated. My thoughts and prayers are with all who lost their lives, were injured, or affected in any way by yesterday's events. And also for Travis, who I know cares deeply for his fans and for Houston community, I want to make it clear we weren't aware of any fatalities until the news came out after the show and no world will have continued filming or performing i am sending my deepest condolences to all the families during this difficult time and we'll be praying for the healing of everyone who has been impacted now she said this because the part about we wouldn't continue to show if we knew people was hurt or, or, or you know killed or died because they were saying that Travis Scott intentionally kept doing the show, even though Amos was out there, even though people was yelling at him to quit the show. Man, it's loud. He might not know what no fans were doing. You know, these fans are rabid. So if you're yelling at him, he might not know why you're yelling at him. But those out there who are blaming Travis Scott, saying he continued the show, even though people had died, and even though people were injured. If he's going to blame Travis, blame Travis for the lack of, of doing their due diligence and making sure these people's under control before the show started. If you want to blame them for something, that's how I feel. But that's what Travis and his lady had to say. Let me know how y'all feel. I am AKA Bands and Supporters TV. Like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I'm out. Peace.